This is a QuickBooks demonstration on how to create an invoice and receive payment. This is the first in a series of videos for the clients of Washington Consultants LLC and those interested in learning how to use QuickBooks. We'll get started by showing our main screen where you can go to any area of the software from the main screen. We'll first look at the icon for creating invoice, which is now highlighted in the yellow. You'll see that when we click on that screen, you'll have a blank window that says create invoice. On that window, you see information that will highlight customer job, the bill to area, the ship to area, as well as quantity and item. Now you do see the highlighted area uh, that I've just mentioned. We're going to fill those areas in first. In the customer job area, you'll see that now there is information in the customer job area that was previous highlight, previously highlighted for Adams Candy Shop. You'll see the bill to address information as well as the ship to address information. We'll also complete now the quantity area which is the areas that are now highlighted. Item price, the class, and the amount and if the information is tax related. You'll see now where the quantity area is one, that there's a an item code as well as a description for that window. Also, you'll notice that there are terms that have been uh, highlighted, and you'll see the window that now says that we've changed some of the terms information, and we need to confirm if this is the information that we want to appear next time. Once we click on that, then that invoice has been completed. Now you'll see the highlighted area receives payment, which is the next step in completing this process. So now you'll see the blank customer window that shows the various areas that will be completed. Well, as we did before, highlight the areas that we will deal with first. Now that would be who we're receiving the payment from, the dollar amount, the payment method, the check number, as well as where it's being deposited to, which would be our checking account. Once we've completed that information, now you'll see that Adam's Candy Shop has been filled in for the receive from payment because that's who we created the invoice for also that you'll see that the check number information has been input as well as the check in information. Now also then now you'll see the highlighted areas for the next information that we'll complete. The number, invoice number, the original amount of the invoice, the amount due, and how much of that was actually paid. Now then, and then that will save and close the payment information. Once we've done that, then you'll see that we have now a completed paid invoice that has the page stamp on it. That is a simple demonstration of how to receive a payment and how to create an invoice. This video is completed by Washington Consultants, LLC. Please feel free to reach us online. You can connect with us through our website at www.WashingtonConsultantsLLC.com. We're on Facebook. Twitter, 
and LinkedIn. This is Edna Washington, Washington Consultants. Until next time.